we live in a in in an either or world. I think we live in, an, in a world where it's either this or it's that. And the concept that you can be in joy and and pain in at the same time is foreign to us. People even feel guilty for it. I just lost my dad. I can't feel joy. I just lost my 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 son to suicide. I I can't feel joy. I'm never going to feel joy again. I had a woman tell me once in a suicide support group, I am never going to be happy again. I am never going to feel joy again. And I said, okay, that's your, that's up to you. Of course she will. But that was where she was in the moment. In our society, we would typically tell that person, oh, yes, you will. You'll feel that. And in and, 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 and me saying to her, okay, it didn't diminish her pain. We tend to diminish each other's pain. But we never diminish each other's joy. So so being in a space of, we laughed harder at Tracy's funeral than, I mean, it's pro- probably ridiculous how much we laughed at Tracy's funeral. <laughs> and it was because it was the joy of what he created in that moment. And I have had many, 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 many days where I did not feel joy since he died. But I know it's there. It's just on the other side waiting for me that it that it's there um it is sort of the same side of the coin but it is also i think you have to be willing to feel it you have to be willing to say i can be happy and sad at the same time two things can be true at once 